Aussie Central guinea pig rescue. And then we've got number three. So this is the one you got from Byron the, Bay last winter. Right. She's, she looks very healthy. So you found her, was she being given away or like what, what's we her story? We visited people and they just had her, look. she was lonely she's and she was so own. shy, oh. you could not touch her. She was so scared and okay. they had an open. Yeah. All the cats could be. I, oh. And I, I offered to take her. Yeah. Now she has friends. I told him either you have to get a companion for her or I'm happy to take her. And then they called us the next day, you can have her. Mm -hmm. So we brought her. And oh, that's really good. And she was like a devil to our other sevens. I've oh, never really? seen. I've, she attacked everyone. I've oh, never okay. seen that. But only because she was so scared. Okay. Yeah. So it's, it took us three or four days, yes. supervised, supervised, lots of space, and then yes. she was, she's absolutely fine. It's really interesting when I found it so many times when guinea pigs are on their own, yeah. particularly females, for some time, she's, they can be so feisty when they start yeah, out. But she wasn't bad. She was no. really terrified, we've had, we've had terrified of all the others, and that's, oh, that's why she it. It's them. attack first. Yeah. 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 Talk what later. This one does. And yes. she never bites. <laughs> She never bites anymore. Yeah. She's just completely off and she's fully accepted by the mob. Super cute. Super, super she's cute. She's got these big eyes. She's I've gorgeous. Down here, little girl. She's good. Her name is Monica. Monica. She had that what? name already. Monica. That is a cute name. That is a very, very cute Monica. name. Monica. That's what you would use out here, Monica, <laughs> oh god, she's good. Oh, look, she doesn't hate it. She likes it. Oh, look, it. She enjoys it. It just uh, removes out a little oh. bit of build up that's there. It's yeah. quite dry in her ears. Um, so yeah, I would give each of them a Malaseb bath. Okay. And when you do, and you've got them in the water, make sure you do this to their ears. Oh, okay, yeah. Just to get the Malaseb on there because it's... On Malaseb in the ears. No, just like this. So the Malaseb you put on their backs, yep. give them a shampoo. Yep. So in the water, yep. put it on your hands and just go oh, okay. like that. So it's yep. sort of diluted and just rubbing yep. it on okay. there because it'll get into these folds okay. and uh, just clean them really well. Yeah. That's all. But Monica, you're very cute. How old is she? Do you I know? don't know. Okay. Because she was, the lady rescued her yeah. from a it's amazing the stories that yeah. you know some of these people go through. Yeah. There really is Fabio is we'll put his story up shortly. There we go. Oh good. Yeah. So yeah, she's great. She's nothing there. Are you revolutioning them? Or no, are you no. making? No. Oh not you definitely right, you definitely oh. So, I thought you only do that when they have mites. No, do no. it I would be doing it now with them because they've got um when they've got flaky hair, a uh, flaky skin, right down at the coat level, it's time to. Okay, to what do I do? It. Tell me. So give them a Malisa bath to begin with, yeah. and then when they're completely dry, mm -hmm. um, we'll put some revolution. We'll put some ivermectin on here, and can I just buy that? We have it here. Oh, yeah, but I've got and the other five at home. Sorry, I've got the other five guinea pigs. Yeah, those are all of them. Yeah, we'll do that. Do can you yeah. give me the drops? Yeah, yeah, I can oh, do that. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can give them to you here. Good. And then just take that back and then do all of them. Mm -hmm. And then repeat it in one week's time. Yep. Because you need to do it twice. Let's have a look at what... Between the shoulder blade, between the ears? Is no, I'll one? show you how to do it. Goes on behind the ears. You can always find here. something, this woman. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's the first one to show signs of it. See? See this yep, in her coat? Dry, dry skin, yeah. Yeah, this is all fungal, fungally fried, but it's the first sign of mites as well. Oh, okay. So, perfect timing to come here. Oh. Yeah, there we go. I've agitated it all. You can see it. Or I've lifted it. Yeah, it's all coming out there. What is it? Yeah, so they've definitely got mites. Oh my god. But it's just starting. Like oh. It's you know, only just starting. Oh, We've had, so, we haven't had them for a long time. No, not at all. No, but um, it's change of season now. Okay. And yeah. Oh gosh, I'm just disrupting all this and hard skin. And it was a bit moist, there. maybe that they like the hay. They love it. They love humidity. The yeah. And we had all that water mm, for the yeah. when it rained so badly, and then that really hot, hot, hot day, mm. which was so humid. So yeah, mm, right yeah. now is perfect time for mites. It really is. So yeah, so you just need to give them a bath, a Malaseb bath, when you get back. For her, it's all up and down. I don't really. 
you can see that or not, but all that that's what the comb is hitting. See all that dead skin that's being lifted? That's yeah, what I the comb it, is yeah. hitting. It's like, yeah. Mm, yeah. So this little girl's got it all happening. Hey, whoa. Oh, yeah. hey, I'm just lifting hey, it, so. Hey. So what we'll do, we will ivermec all three right now. Yeah. Normally we'd give them a bath, but it's just getting too cold to do that here. Yeah. But what we'll do, I'll leave the bathing for you if you do that in a couple of days time. Yeah. But we'll ivermec them now, which will just eradicate all the parasites. Two days time, give them a nice, when it's sunny, give mm -hmm. them a nice bath and that will just clear up yep. this dandruff looking yep. appearance. And then in a week, so like exactly today week, we're going on you're holidays. going to... Oh, okay. When do you go? Um, Monday. What's today? For Wednesday. 12 days. I would do them again on Monday. It doesn't okay. matter. It's a couple of days early. Okay. And worst case scenario, you just do it again when you return. Okay. So, yeah. So we do all of them. Yeah, definitely yeah. do it again. Okay. So we'll either make them now. So what you're going to do is some in there. We're going to do 0.4 on each girl for this one. Mm -hmm. So there's 0.4 there. Yep. What I'm going to do is literally rub that in and smear it all over the back of the ear okay. because the ear has more vessels in it to absorb than most places in the body so we just rub that all the way around like that and on this naked area here mm -hmm. spin it around there we go all done so all gone Number we're going to do that for each of them that will be absorbed while you're traveling home and that will just stop this from happening um, mites are microscopic, but you can see the damage that yeah, yeah. is caused with them. Oh, yeah. yeah, perfect timing to bring them up, which is really good. So we'll pop her away and we'll get the me. others back and we'll pop it on them as well. Oh, yeah. what did she do? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good. There we go. Done. The next one, yep. Yeah, so perfect timing for that. And with that stone, we just need to still keep an eye on yep. it. Yeah. Hoping that, um, hoping it relocates a little bit. There we go. Thank you. I had 10 in there, so I'll leave that there. That's awesome.